Hey, what's up? This is Khalid here for After Effects Tutorial. Today I want to show you how to create three pocket of Lay's Chips commercial by 3ds Max and After Effects. Hey guys, there is the biggest news for you. So if you want to learn After Effects CC 2023 Masterclass course from basic to advanced, 2D 3D motion graphics top 25 plugins with free download setup up to 4 hours video don't forget the link is in video description this is a sample model in 3ds max and there is the animated chips so let's start first go to 3ds max create a pocket of chips by these modifiers create a box then create ffd box for controlling and edit poly for creating some edges. then create mesh smooth noise for controlling some noise tapper relax and for materials then select these three pockets go to file export selected export obj lace obj then there is another important animated models select all of them then go to scripts run scripts export to obj sequence open create a folder then name it save from 0 to 150 frames export so now after that go to after effects create a new project new composition right here lays commercial five seconds press ok so let's create first the background create a new solid press ok right here background then control plus y create another new solid right here wave enter go to effects and presets right here radio waves double click play then go to radio wave effect control there is fade in time and start wait make little bit more weight like this so change the color little bit dark like this press ok and here is the expansion and need more start weight play now there's so select the wave right click go to pre compose move all attributes name it wave then create the solid create a mask on the solid change press m press a4 for the more option inverted so now there is inverted i want to put 3d models of the lace pockets down here close and lock both right click create a new another solid right here uh, element 3d and go to effects then go to video copilot.net so after that go to scene setup after scene setup let's import the 3d model of obj go to import click there is the project select lays obj open okay here is so let's create shiny's pockets but how first expand the lace group select the first one go to presets physical apply the golden material select again go to material diffuse select go to desktop then go to project select the rate 
material press ok and go to control the color in basic setting make bright reflectivity down to dark and go to illumination turn on for the more reflection like this so now go to reflection again and there is the reflection need little bit reflect like this go to environment change the environment go to backlights too here is a lot of backlights select one of them which one select this one press open open so let's control again press ok and go to illumination need more brighter so let's create a little bit more reflection now go back to second and right click copy material duplicate paste the material here and just change the material select uh, there is the big problem let's apply directly change and select the second press ok white and go to where reflectivity little bit make dark and go to illumination need more bright so need more little bit and change 360 so after this select the third apply the third material change the material here press ok change the color to white and go back to reflection change to little bit black turn on and make more brighter here is the final and you can control you can change the reflections press before pressing ok let's create here the what create a new plan model and expand and move it down I want to change this one to matter apply and right click go to reflect mode matter surface and select your material go down here there is uh, the matte reflection just I want to see the reflection press ok so right click create a new what a camera 24 press ok then select again the element 3d and go back to expand more the plan size need bigger size for the plan like this need more huge size press ok so after this let's animate the pockets but how the easy way we can create a um, tree group for the three pockets or the another way let's control the camera like this control the camera then select before continue save your project save the project here uh, name it lace TV commercials okay go to group 1 go to particle look and turn on the multi object animate there is the rotation for the boat and there is the displacement press shift for the fast so now go back to particle replicator move front of the camera like this come to second one then stopwatch then come to 15 frames change 
to zero. So after five frames, go back to rotation stopwatch, go back to displays, and come to second two, change it to zero and zero. When we play, here is. So for animated object, right click, create another new solid, and right here, element 3D, uh, animate. Press enter, go back to effect, select again the element 3D, then go to scene, set up, wait for the open, here is. For animated sequences, you must go to File, Import 3D Sequence. Then select from the motion zero, press Open, OK. Here is. Move it up, go back to Physical Materials and apply the Match Shadow. On where? Just on the plan. Apply Match Shadow. Press OK. So after this, let's see the result. Let's see where is, let's turn off the first 3D and select the second element 3D, go to group 1, particle look, and move up. Press shift, a little bit fast, move it up, move up, and go to particle look, make huge size, move up more move up a little bit change the size like this play where is the plan the plan is looking down here and go to render setting turn on for the shadow ambient occlusion turn on here is here is the ambient occlusion make the quality shadow to 32 and need a little bit radius and distribution and intensity looking good so now go to lighting change the lighting to basic let's check the dramatic check the cinema or you can control additional lighting go to rotation control the lighting like this here is not bad so now let's play after second one. Press Alt, break, and turn on the element 3D first. So after animated delays, the chips falling from up. Play. Here is. Let's move a little bit more down here. Move down here. Good. Let's a little bit change the size and move it up here and move a little bit to right side. looking good let's play here is the final result of the chips play play Thirty frame in 3ds Max is one second animation. Okay, go back to render setting and go to motion blur. Turn on the motion blur. Make 250. 
and uh, select again the wave, select, press M for the mask pad, move it a little bit more down here. So let's little bit zoom the camera and let's move it up, little bit move up here and let's uh, animate. Animate after second one. Second one, save your project, fit and render. A uh, little bit more problem. Let's control the lighting of the lace pockets. Go to render setting, go to lighting. Let's check 360. Uh, let's go to rotation, additional lighting. Let's control this. Let's animate. Select, turn on all of them, go to five seconds. Select. Let's animate like this. Uh, let's render again. Turn off the solo and here is guys the final result of the lace animation by 3D Max and After Effects in Element 3D. Thank you for watching. Don't forget like, subscribe the channel for the more best tutorials. Have a good time. Good luck.